Hi, Mr. X with Glossary Term Inverse Trig Function. Given any of our six basic trigonometric functions, sine, cosine, tangent, cotangent, secant, or cosecant, each of these has an inverse, and what the inverse trig function does is returns the angle. I think that's the key phrase, whose original trig function produces the given number. From the good folks at Wolfram, we have some graphics of these inverse trig functions. Some trig teachers put a lot of emphasis on these graphs. Well, I think of this more as for math people. I think the real power of trigonometry is being able to solve problems. It doesn't hurt you to know what these graphs look like. But to be blunt, I don't carry these around with me. I have to look them up when I need them. I know what they are, and I know what the basic trig functions look like. But the inverse trig functions, well, if I need them, I'll go find them. Understand what's at work here. The inverse trig function returns the angle whose original trig function produces the number. Mr. X, Mentor of Mathematics at MrXMath.com